Exploring the depth of soul-touching phrases. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're going to dive into the beautiful realm of emotive language and explore what it means when we describe something as soul-touching. This phrase is a powerful tool in English, capable of conveying deep emotional resonance. Let's unravel the layers of this expression together. When we say something is soul-touching, we're talking about a deep emotional impact that moves us in a profound way. It's an experience that resonates with our innermost feelings, often leaving a lasting impression. This can be triggered by various forms of art, nature, human actions, or any experience that reaches the core of our being. Art and Music a painting or song might be described as soul-touching if it evokes strong emotions or a sense of connection. Acts of kindness. Witnessing or receiving a genuine act of kindness can touch our souls by its pure intent and the warmth it spreads. Nature's wonders. Sometimes, the sheer beauty of nature, a breathtaking sunset or the serene sound of waves, can be so overwhelming that it touches our soul. Let's see how soul-touching can be used. The violinist's performance was so soul-touching that it brought tears to my eyes. Her heartfelt letter was a soul-touching gesture of friendship. The phrase soul-touching isn't just about deep feelings. It's about human connection and empathy. By using such phrases, we communicate the intensity of our experiences and share our inner world with others, creating bonds that transcend the ordinary. We hope this exploration of soul touching has indeed touched your soul and enriched your understanding of this evocative phrase. Emotive language is a key to unlocking shared human experiences, and soul touching is a perfect example of this. Keep feeling keep learning, and let's continue to share the language of the soul. Until next time, 